happenings, global happenings today. We communicate. We analyze global news. Stay tuned. Still on the issue of uh, Simfobara, the defected lawmakers, reverse lawmakers, Vijay Sovike and his loyalists, I look like it is the time for exposing as each one of them are opening up on some of the nitty gritties, the behind the scene matters that have eluded Nigerians that out of um, tensions and emotions that are releasing it. And of course, it all began with him, um, Rike's very strong ally, who, was, who happened to be the former attorney general decided to call out Fubara and one Nigerians so who Fubara truly is. And of course, Fubara and letting them know also that this game, getting it together and win and wins all, also decided to respond. And the matter in question all here revolves around who Wiki is, who Fubara is, and his loyalist as his exposure galore. My colleagues are also in the house, but let's quickly run through both sides, what they said about one another, and you will decide who is really telling the truth in this matter. Now, according to the former Attorney General, a river state that's Professor Zacchaeus Adongo has said that Fubara is not the person people think he is, while claiming that the river state governor is not a peacemaker. Now, according to the news, Adongo said that this while also revealing that he resigned from Fubara's cabinet in April because he refused to obey the governor when he allegedly asked him to institute suits to challenge the validity of the presidential peace part by President Bola Tinubu on the feud between Fubara and Wiki. Adonga, who stated that his political loyalty is to the former governor of River State, which is Jason Wiki, claimed that he never applied to work for Governor Fubara, but he was invited to serve under him. Addressing the issue, Adonga said, I will give you two instances to show that he, Fubara, is not a person people think he is. He is not a peacemaker. I have been on leave from River State University, where I have primary duty. I resigned on April 24, 2024. Fubara expected me to return to the university, but I'm aware that he instituted the, he instructed the institution's management not to allow me to do so. A person with a trinkle disposition cannot make such a decision. He added that the governor declined to issue a warrant establishing a customary court in his local community just to punish him. And of course, Fubara, not letting the matter lie low, have also decided to call him out and also the strong, stronger uh, men of Yeston Wiki. And the River State Governor has urged the former Commissioner for Justice, that's Zakios Adongo, to clarify the circumstances surrounding his resignation. In a statement by the Commissioner for Information and um, Communication, that's Wari Sinibo Joe Johnson, the Simfobara's government dismissed Adongo's assertion that he left his post due to reluctancy in pursuing legal action against the presidential proclamation on the state political discord, Adongo is a staunch supporter of the FCT minister, Yeso Wiki, and he stated that there is no doubt about his loyalty to Wiki. Meanwhile, Joe Johnson stated, it is widely known that Mr. Adongo, senior advocate of Nigeria, explicitly mentioned in his resignation letter dated 24th, 24th April 2024 on Ministry of Justice letterhead following his deployment as Commissioner for Special Duties governor's office he stated that he would not accept reassignment and falsely claimed that the governor was meddling in his duties the state statement continued it's perplexing that instead of addressing serious allegation made by his excellency sir similar for barra gssrs branding him a supporter the land senior advocate of uh, nigeria has resorted to business accusation and falsehood it will be expected uh, for the senior advocate of Nigeria to refute such a grave accusation to salvage his reputation rather than attempting to distort facts to divert attention. The government emphasized, considering the governor's track record, it is improbable that he would interfere with the former Attorney General and Commissioner for Justice Duty or prompt Professor Odango to initiate legal action against the president regarding the political crisis in River State. It's evident that Professor Zakios Adango, senior advocate of Nigeria's son, resigned abruptly from the state executive council due to revelations about his character most astonishing astonishingly as a law professor professor adongo inappropriately used the official ministry of justice letterhead instead of his personal stationery to tender his resignation the statement concluded with a challenge to professor zakios adongo senior advocate of nigeria san to provide clarity and transparency regarding his escapades. My colleague is here. What's your take? Well, for me, it's uh, rather very on 
thinking about that a professor of that repute, a professor of that class will make such statement. You are being called to save under a particular government and you don't want to show loyalty to that government. You are showing loyalty to someone who is outside that government and you feel that you should be allowed to stay automatically. No, I won't even allow that to happen. Imagine, for example... He resigned. Okay, he has resigned. Now, imagine, for example, if uh, you get married to a, 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 your wife and your wife is showing loyalty to his father and her father. to her father and leaving you behind this father, father both of you are supposed to be immediate from the pursuing the same goal and achieving things for your future i mean what fubara what is doing to him he wants him to come to to terms with the reality on ground he wants to bring him to knee so that he will understand that working for fubara means working for river state government but working for wiki means working for selfish personal gain which will pay you nothing I, I, I think at this point, um, the way things are going, Wiki has nothing to offer. Because listening to what this guy has said, that's uh, the former attorney general of uh, River State has said, who, had, who is a supporter of Wiki, what he has said, said he had resigned since April. And if Wiki has a lot to offer, he would have rolled out his plans. They were praying that this day would not come, but unfortunately he's here with us. These days are here with us, and right now he's fidgeting and thinking of the next strategy. And the only way anything can happen right now is for the president to go against the rule of law, which is even trying to protect, because one of the things that he has sworn to uphold was the rule of law, the supremacy of the law above all men. You understand? So right now the situation is very precarious. It's unexplainable. It, it's such that... Uh, any reasonable person will just have to rest and leave that for them to handle uh, so that he can concentrate and do his work. I think, uh, for, for me personally, I think um, uh, it's self-explanatory. If he openly and brazenly told the sitting governor that my loyalty lies with his your predecessor, lies with your with the former governor, it clearly shows that you have no business being work. in my team. Exactly. Go and work with him in reverse. In, because in whoever I am bringing into my team must already to work with me and be loyal with loyal to me. This is an executive arm. Of we course. We should work like a team to yes. get reversed to the next level. Exactly. But if you're already loyal to the person who's no longer on seat, then you are as good as an enemy. Of course. That's one. Then secondly, he even openly opened up and he opened up and said that his loyalty lies with a wicked. I mean, it is it's unbelievable. <laughs> it's unbelievable that in matter of that repeat would that academic record will say such a thing? You get to me, it's even the highest level of belittling. I'm telling you, been letting him know that uh, you're just there for figurehead. And he said something so unique that I couldn't, but, you, know, you know, highlight. He said that I was called to serve, I didn't apply. Hmm. They called me to come and serve in your government, which means I, I didn't even see you as somebody coming. Somebody told me to just come and serve, to come and help you. You know, sir. So this is, is normal. Maybe uh, by the time he got in there, he didn't see what he liked or something. Because uh, you don't expect, and he's not saying something very unique. After he didn't say, you now want to go back to your place and he's saying the governor wrote out. Uh, those ones are actually political terms. I don't know how true that is. But the one we know is the fact that you can't be in somebody's team. Look at it. Take a very close look at the president's cabinet. President Bola Matinubu. He brought in the people he trusts, the people he knows. Some people have been shouting out, ah, but I think we brought in a globalization. He brought in people he knows he can trust with the economy of the nation. People he knows that we got his, that got his back, that we have his back, even if it's not on seats. And this, that's how governance is done, unfortunately. That's, of how course. We, that's how we do it here in Nigeria. Of course, it's really this happening, what is going on. And I know that right now, most of them are regretting. You all of a sudden you wake up and you're planning to impeach the governor for what? Because he did not ascend to your own loss, which you just sat down by yourself and created while he is the boss of the it doesn't work that so we're gonna see more of this. I, I feel that right now what we are seeing is a process of sanitizing the system so that he can start working for the river state people. And he's doing a good job, I must say. That's what we'd like to wrap it.